This is the upper endoscopy for gastroesophageal reflux disease. To our surprise, we find this large nodular lesion in the middle of the esophagus with semicircular involvement of the wall. It is a bizarre polypoid mass and the nodules have some fibrin covering and resemble hyperplastic polyps within the stomach. Above the lesion there is some esophagitis. Let us have a look at the lesion in the FICE mode. In this case, virtual chromoendoscopy does not help us to demarcate the lesion as there is no increased vascularization of the lesion. In a next step, we perform Lugol staining of the mucosa. We find regular uptake of the iodine solution with a homogeneous and regular brown staining of the esophageal mucosa. The complete surface of the lesion surface is also stained with Lugol's dye. This strongly argues against a malignant lesion, especially a squamous cell carcinoma. Biopsy sampling from the lesion revealed typical histology of an esophageal papilloma. The following images show the typical appearance of small papillomas as you know them from routine upper This is the upper endoscopy for gastroesophageal reflux disease. To our surprise, we find